My name is Zachary Cedarbaum from Feed the Starving Artists. I represent the group of artists that created this piece, The Empress Has No Shame. It is a response to the naked Donald Trump statue, The Emperor Has No Balls. It was created for several reasons. First, on the political side, the Republicans and Democrats in our group have varying ideals on what's going on in this election. And to let everybody know, this was made by a group of men and women, Hillary and Donald supporters, before anybody starts criticizing. The reason why is because a lot of the, the Republicans obviously have issues with Benghazi, which is why you see one vote for Benghazi, four drops of the weapon of the American Lives Lost. All of us have issues with the email scandal that's going on. It's 33,000 emails down there. And as you go up past her cloven hooves, you see Big Bank suckling on her tit. And that represents our dismay with the money going into the election process and political system in this country. Not just with Hillary, but in general. And we're not happy with that. And then through putting this statue out, very serious social issues came to light. Two of which the double standards of body shaming and freedom of speech. Now, there's plenty of people that applauded the Donald statue that got offended by this, like the woman Nancy that attacked it in the financial district last week. That's why it's missing hands. She jumped on it, ripped them off, called for other people to join in. And then when we had people on the street trying to put it back up, she got fired. And that proved that freedom of speech in this country is not under attack by the government, it's not under attack by the media, it's under attack by our friends, our family, our neighbors, and our coworkers. And until we can have conversations on both sides and find a middle ground, nothing is going to improve in this country and we're going to keep on sliding downwards. And that's really what this piece represents. I mean, this is Democrats, Republicans, men, women, and we were able to come together to create a piece for social change. If we can do that, so can everybody else.